Striking state attorneys have accused the National Labor Commission for failing to follow proper procedure before calling their strike illegal. The state attorneys are therefore at the neck of the commission to immediately call for a compulsory arbitration to resolve the matter. The strike by the state attorneys have entered its second week without any resolution. Although the chief of staff has directed the finance ministry to harmonize their conditions of service, the ministry is yet to conclude with the exercise. However, the National Labor Commission has summoned the state attorneys for a meeting to resolve their grievances. But the attorneys insist the NLC has acted in contravention of the labor law. They have not done their work at all, and I am using this channel to inform them to refer them to section 160, subsection 2, that they, what is left for them to do now is to call for compulsory arbitration. And it should be pursuant to section 164 of the Labor Act, which is the, the act that governs their operation. They cannot be seen to call us now or to invite us to a meeting telling us to call off the strike. There's a procedure for calling of a legal strike and they must follow their process. The attorneys are therefore asking the commission to rather call for a compulsory arbitration. They have defended their decision for the continuous strike until their issues are resolved. The Labor Commission has not invited us to any meeting today. We have just been handed over this letter. As at the time they told the public they hadn't invited us to any meeting. This letter I have in my hand has just been handed over to me. I received it at 10.50 this morning. That the letter was handed over to me and asking us for a meeting at one. And in fact, the content of the letter needs, means that we should appropriately respond because they are saying that their the, 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 the letter was prompted by a, a letter written by the second respondent.